Hey everybody, this is John with Gyps Paranormal, and man has it been so long since I've said those words. Uh, lately, over the winter season, I've kind of taken a break, a very long, trudging break from YouTube and making videos, and I apologize for that. I know I put out a vlog that was a uh, I need some advice vlog. Um, since then, things have gotten better. Um, we... After my dog had passed away, we were still coping with that. Um, alongside with that, my mom, we got her a new puppy. Uh, her name is Bella, and she's such a sweetheart. She almost looks exactly like our old dog, which kind of brings back memories, because she not only looks like her, but she acts like her, and does those cute little things that puppies do, tear into stuff and this and that, that she used to do as well. So it's, it's nice. Um, alongside with that, uh, mom actually started a new business, and it's called Bertha's Barkery. Now, her, my old dog's name was Bertha, and so she wanted to create a business in her name. And so, she makes, like, special dog treats, puppy treats, this, that, and the other for, uh, production and selling. So that's hopefully going to be kicking off here soon. But going along the sides of me, uh, spiritually, and Gyps in general, uh, things have picked up wonderfully. Um, since the beginning of the new season for investigating, we have went with Sarah and Soul Patrol to Alvira. Um, just last month, we went to the second cemetery with Debbie, and it was just Sarah, Debbie, and I, and we went there because it was mom's first time she's ever been to Alvira. Um, she wanted to get a feel of the location, and so we only had time late at night to go to the second cemetery and a couple of the bunkers to kind of see what they were like. Um, mom said that she felt a little uneasy, but at peace. And that's kind of how I felt when I first went there myself. Um, but going along from that... We have been booking more investigations. Like I said, we were at Alvira. Um, we are looking to see about possibly going up to Allison's grave again. Um, we're actually talking to a couple of other people and clients throughout all of Pennsylvania to see about investigating their haunted claims that they have. Um, we actually have a home in Williamsport that was the documentary home that we filmed in that we're hoping to go back actually this Saturday. So I'm really looking forward to that. I know it seems like I'm going through this video so fast. I just... There's so much information and so little time that I could really talk. Um, spiritually with me, uh, my abilities have been like... Whoa. Um, I haven't really been working on them, but with not working on them, it's kind of gotten stronger. I know, it doesn't really make sense. But... I've been able to pick up on some spirits, not only at locations, but attached to people. Um, I actually read my French teacher before school one time, and uh, I picked up on her deceased grandfather. And when I told her basically a couple of things that they used to do when she was a child. And it was very, very, very interesting. And I actually learned today, because today we were talking about the word seance. Now, seance is not really originated in uh, French language, but um, it means to show, like to show a movie in French, and so um, Americans adopt, adopted that term as the occult. Um, that's when, in 1920s, when the occult came famous, um, and so seances were done to talk to the dead, kind of like what we do. And so she went on a whole 20-minute uh, conversation on that during our period. So it was kind of nice. Um, but other than that, my abilities have picked up. Um, I don't really have any more to say about that. But um, going along to future events, uh, Gyps is hoping to, like I said, plan more investigations. But not only that, we're looking to start more events going on here and start booking outside of Pennsylvania and to see about going to Paracons and this and that. 
So, on July 9th, there is the Rolling Hills Paracon, which is at the Rolling Hills Asylum in East Bethany, New York. Um, we're looking to go there. I know Sarah was talking about going with a friend to Gettysburg uh, just a little before then to celebrate around the 4th of July. So, we're trying to book all that. It's kind of hard because after a while, the expenses kind of accumulate up and... You know, want to do more than you can actually afford, in my opinion. But, I just wanted to let everyone know that I am back at making more videos. I am hoping that things pick up, not only here, but at the Facebook page. Um, if you want, you can head over to our Facebook page at facebook.com slash junior investigating paranormal society. Hit that like button and show us some support, and I will leave the links down below. Uh, you can also visit our Twitter page at twitter.com slash at gypsparanormal. And if you have not already, go ahead down below and subscribe to us to see more from not only me, but from my entire team. More paranormal investigations, spear box sessions, uh, equipment tutorials, and so much more. Um, Exciting news. Exciting news is going to come up, and I look forward to sharing that with everyone here in the future. So, thank you again so much for all the continued support, and I hope to see more from everyone here soon. So, thank you for watching. Have a nice night, and I will talk with you later. Bye-bye.